Hello everyone, I'm Dragons After Dark, and today we're going over the abhorrent adversaries of the afterlife fight with Briarpaw. Briarpaw can be found in Ardenweald, and I'll put the coordinates in the description below. Today, I have two teams for this fight, one short and one that takes longer, but your pet will finish with 100% HP. The first team we'll be using for this fight and most of the adversaries is the Seaborn Spore, the Crimson Spore, and Baal. All of these enemies have the boss buff, which means it reduces all damage they take by 50%, and they cannot be dealt more than 35% of their health at a time. What this team does here, and for all the adversaries, is bypass that 50% damage debuff using health percentage attacks. And that's it! Our next team consists of one pet, and though it does take longer, your pet will finish the fight with full HP. You'll need any rabbit with scratch, dodge, burrow, and greater than 223 speed, which is probably all of them. Keep in mind that after you get to round 7, you will only have one scratch between burrow landing and needing to use dodge, which is why you repeat from round 2 instead of round 1. I enjoyed making this fight because you use a critter against an enemy with a beast attack, and yet you take no damage at all because of the rabbit's two avoidance abilities combined with Briar Paw's two non-attack abilities. This fight can also be done with Wagon, the Slithershock Elver, Scrapyard Tunneler, Alloyed Alley Rat, and Specimen 97. It's also possible to do this with Inky, the Nameless Octopode, and the Sneaky Marmot, but you use the blind on turn 2 and pass on turn 3, which loses one round of attack and will make this take longer. And that's it! Two easy wins for Briarpaw, and you're one step closer to your Winterleaf Spriggan. Grats! I wish you all the best of luck, thank you for stopping by, and happy battling!